Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be cleaning this saddle pad. It's a lime one and as you can see, it's filthy and full of chestnut hairs. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean this pad. Um, I can't remember what sign I did there for and it was minging. Yeah, so it was minging. So we're going to go clean it. So this is the front of the saddle pad. It's the lime one, as I would said. And this is a close of the inside. Like As you can see, it is just plain old disgusting um yeah so we definitely need to clean this and it was just all greasy and full of fur from when i used it on donny so yeah it's pretty minging and like <laughs> they were getting everywhere like and you can't put this on any other color horse otherwise it will make them go chestnut so in the next clip you'll see my tool so I got this off somebody's YouTube channel, I forgot what YouTube channel it was, but they use like a knife and um, because the knife has little ridges on it which pulled out the hair so I thought I'd grab myself a knife with little ridges on and then my camera is not focusing to save its life but that's... So here I've grabbed the saddle pad and I set it up so you guys can see me doing it so this is what you do you grab the knife and you just like kind of scrape away at the hairs and what it does is the little like i don't know what you call it the little grilly bit on it the little grill bit on the knife just like pulls away at the hairs and flicks them out the little crevices i know it's not the best angle to see but you can actually see it coming out a bit but i obviously will show you guys the close-up after this clip so you just got to get your knife and scrub away at it so this is what oh, i'm showing you guys another close-up um, yeah here we go here's the knife and here is what it does it just scratches away you can see that all the hairs coming loose um once they come loose obviously you pick them off or brush them off or whatever shake your saddle pads and they'll all come off it is like a tough process and you do have to work at it for a while some hairs may be stuck in worse than others depends how long you like have left it for but yeah so this is me cleaning the saddle pad and i'll probably make this a bit into a time lapse Here I've got another angle for you guys so you can see a bit of a better angle of me getting rid of the hairs off it and I don't know if you can see but I think you can, I'm not too sure if the hairs are coming off or what, it's not the best of angle if I'm not going to lie but here you can just see me scrubbing away with the knife so yeah. So this next idea involves a magic brush and like a sturdy dandy brush. I don't know if this idea has been done or not. I've not really seen any videos about it, but this is what I thought. So you use a magic brush to scrape away at the hairs and it actually works because it does actually loosen the hairs. But you got to be careful because it does pull at the squares a bit and obviously it makes them go a bit fuzzy and a bit, but it does work. And you will see in the next clip, the dandy brush will help loosen up the hairs, but it also helps scrape away the hairs off the saddle pad, which is great. Then you don't get them everywhere all over you. And I don't know, I just feel like it helps a lot more than the, than the knife did. So here's a bit of a close up or a different version of me using the magic brush to scrape away and ignore my rolls because they're very, but these shots were very tight. So um, yeah, I'm just scraping away and using the bigger brush to scrape all the hairs off as you can see i'm trying to brush all the hairs off so they actually don't get put back into the saddle pad if you get what i mean so just scrub away scrub 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 
scrub and then this is what the pad looked like after it looks so much more better like yes i can see that there is still hairs in there but it looks a huge amount better like it doesn't actually look like there's many chestnut hairs left because when the pad did come it actually had some hairs on it because it was a second hand pad so it looks tons better and it looks great so my pad is now super clean and well a lot better anyway and i'm super happy with the results it looks so much better and yeah i'm super happy with it so this is the end of this video so i don't know what i'm doing but guys i will see you in the next video bye <laughs>